hello everyone in this video i want to talk about yeah new stickers new sticker is one of the most popular feature of a website mostly news and magazine websites for the last few decades but now i think this new sticker is outdated. It's not a thing for 2020s. So uh, here in this video, I will show you how to add new sticker widget in your Elementor WordPress website. But I don't recommend you to use new sticker. Now, most of the users, most of the visitors of your website are mobile phone smartphone users and uh, let's say, see how it looks in mobile phone let's say iphone 7 i plus okay here here the scope is very small here it uh, size is shrink down so it is not showing properly it cannot uh, display all the full text here it's, it can display about two to three words here like this so it's not good design here yeah. it's not showing properly it's okay for in the desktop design but for mobile phone users now we have to consider mobile phone now the train is coming so oh, when we design we have to consider mobile design first so considering mobile design mo mobile design new stickers are not at our thing anymore so if if your client demands it especially i don't suggest you use new stickers it's not a thing anymore and yeah uh, now i have talked about new sticker so let me show you how to add new sticker in your wordpress elementor website it's completely free you don't you don't have to pay extra penny you you install the master errands master errands elementor uh, for elementor free version that is free version you have free download it's available in the wordpress repository too and here like this you can just add uh, new sticker mostly people add this thick new stickers in heading so you can uh, drag and drop the widget in the here Master Aaron's templates here. This is the heading template. It is with Elementor. Let me show you how to add on in the inside the header. Yeah, you, you can just here like this and new sticker new sticker a main new sticker here like this you can drag and drop the thing you can adjust the color style here in the style section you can change the angle color like this uh, and background color like this you can adjust the style color content color navigation color here for this navigation you can adjust the color according to your needs now uh, i don't think this is a new thing you are familiar if you are familiar with the elementor then you are familiar all this design section so let me talk about this uh, most of the settings content type there is rs bit type content type if you are not familiar just leave to the font content 
design options here if you want to change the level here breaking news instead of say latest updates etc you can change it and if you want to hide a level uh, tick this and you can hide the level but by default i will leave the level here new step title extra here you can show the extra of the post or page or content you can show thumbnail too but i don't recommend you to show thumbnail if you uh, the new if the new sticker is in the header then i don't use to uh, i don't use to show thumbnail but uh, it is inside the content section under the page after under the header then you can show thumbnail highlight words so that and hide of the hide of this new sticker you can adjust it the, this default height about 40 pixel uh, is okay for the header and animation yeah what i then horizontal scroll vertical scroll and there are two types of scroll and there are three types of is the uh, uh, animation and an auto play auto play interplay push hover animated speech you can adjust it according to your needs here navigation show navigation this one you can hide also this navigation and uh, navigation size you can increase or decrease post query yeah do, do you want to show post or do you want to show type if you use this post you can uh, you can uh, exclude or include carry the carry the types of post by category or tag or you can show paste number of limits post limit 5 by default is 5 you can increase or decrease order by date author i think you are you are familiar with this uh, this is basic wordpress settings most of the if you are familiar with the element uh, pro or other uh, element uh, post widgets most of the post, post widgets use such type of post query so i think you are familiar with it if, if if you have still thoughts after this watching this video then you can leave a comment below i will try to explain to you personally uh, yeah like this uh, there is not much uh, uh, contain much setting here is just uh, you just have to drag this uh, widget and drop anywhere you like so this is how you add new sticker in your elementor wordpress website but i have to remind you again i don't recommend you to use new sticker in your website unless until now unless your client demands it specifically so thanks for watching again and you, you and you don't forget to the subscribe button.